we will have a short devotion mga isang oras so have a, a comfortable seat so mababa tong ano na actually it will be a short one kasi nakalagay doon short devotion so uh what the topic uh, the theme for our summer camp is equipping the believers so why are we equipping the believers because so that we will have attain the ultimate goal which is to evangelize the whole world amen, amen. not just to change us but also to evangelize the whole world and so brothers and sisters ngayong gabi ang na ano ko na binigay sa akin ni Lord na i-share sa inyo is the only way we can attain it, why we equip ourselves and why we, we think of equipping ourselves because we want to continue gusto natin ituloy so maybe some of us have been here for just for this camp some of us maybe a year or maybe two years some of us has been here for maybe seven years or more and it's been a long a long a long way amen kumbaga along the way there are people who who dropped by people who pressed on people who were blown somewhere else but here we are brothers and sisters i think the my brothers and sisters who are here with me for a long time in uh testify how we have been uh, through tough times and good times but here here we are still we are continuing in our service for the lord amen, amen. so brothers and sisters the topic that i will discuss the title is pressing on because a lot of our brothers have been you know, been in the ministry. A lot of them, for some reason, went to some other place. Some of them were, uh, for some reasons, were not able to continue. For so many reasons, brothers and sisters. But Paul has a reminder to all of us about Isana. Sinulot niya sa mga tao to the people of Philippi. So, brothers and sisters, if you open your Bibles to Philippians chapter 3. Philippians chapter, chapter 3, verses 12 to 21. Ang verse na pag-aaralan natin is pressing on toward the goal. So, I would request uh, Ate Norma to please read the Verses for us. Philippians chapter 3, verse 12 to 21. Philippians uh, 3, 12 to 21. <clears throat> Not as though I had already attained, I there were already perfect, but I follow after, if that I may apprehend that for which also I am apprehended of Christ Jesus. Brethren, I count not myself to have apprehended, but this one thing I do, forgetting those things which are behind and reaching forth unto those things which are before. 14. I press toward the mark for the price of the high calling of God in Christ Jesus. Let us therefore, as many as be perfect, be thus minded, and if in anything ye be otherwise minded, God shall prevail even this unto you. Nevertheless, whereto we have already attained, let us walk by the name, by the same rule, let us mind the same thing. Rule, let us, uh, let us mind the same thing. Brethren, be followers together of me, and mark them which walk, so as he have asked for an is as an in some in sample for many walk of womb I have told you often and now 
tell you, even weeping, that they are the enemies of the cross of Christ, whose end is destruction, whose God is their belly, and whose glory is their shame, who mind early things. For our conversation is in heaven, but from winds also we look for the Savior, the Lord Jesus Christ. 21. Who shall change our vile body, that it may be fashioned like unto his glorious body, according to the working whereby he is able even to subdue all things unto himself? Praise God. Amen. Thank you, Sister Norma. Let us bow our heads. Lord, thank you once again for this wonderful message that you have given to us, Lord. May you guide us, Lord. Give us your wisdom and understanding so that we may understand fully well this message tonight. And may may you make us not just hearers of your word, but doers as well. This we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. So, brothers and sisters, the, me the, the message I would like to impart to you is we have to press on. Amen? Amen. Sabi nga sa verse 12, not that I already have obtained all this or have already been made perfect, but I press on to take hold of what, which Christ, Jesus, took hold of me. Because, you know, brothers and sisters, as we are still alive, we, we never stop, we never stop growing. I mean, siguro yung iba sa atin, we think na we are better off than we were before as, as a Christians, but the Bible is telling us that we, we should never, we should never stop. Never think that you already attain the yung perfect na into a perfect Christian that wants you to be. But aim for yourself to continue to improve in a in a Christian life. Amen? Amen. Because even Paul, brothers and sisters, because you know this uh, Bible verses were written by Paul while probably while he's in a in prison. He said that I do not consider myself yet to have taken hold of it. So even Paul himself, na kilala natin na pinaka one of the greatest evangelizers. Even himself, sinabi na, hindi pa ako perfect, marami pa akong pagkukulang. And brothers and sisters, maybe this should be our, our guidance that even in ourselves, we still have a lot of things that we need to improve in our personal life. I'm telling, telling this to you brothers and sisters, but at the same time, I was also, it is for myself, na lahat tayo, we still need to improve as brothers and sisters in Christ. And Paul said, forgetting what is behind and straining toward what is ahead. Because for some Christians, they are still parang, they are still the slave of their past. Siguro, meron kayo sa nangyari sa buhay nyo somewhere in your life where you still struggle of your past. But brothers and sisters, the Bible is telling us to Paul that we should forget what, what is behind and move forward. I can cite one example, brothers and sisters. You know, for example, Peter. Peter, we know, is one of the greatest disciples of Jesus Christ. He is one of the kumbaga, inner circle of Jesus Christ. We know that there are 12 disciples, but most of the time, uh, only him and a few of the 
disciples are with him. Sila yung parang pinakamalapit sa kanya. But you, you know the story, brothers and sisters, that when Jesus was arrested by the sunny dream, even at first Peter was so uh, angry, right? And he wanted to uh, fight back. But then realizing na yung Jesus was arrested,